Hello, it's Mr. Mange, and I'm here playing um, mission number six of the Stormbirds campaign for Isle to Stormovic, 1946. It's still March in 1945, the end is near, but we're not there yet. It's uh, 5 to 11 in the morning, the weather is acceptable. It's a routine patrol for you this morning. As ever, look out for low-level British reconnaissance planes. If you see them, then destroy them. If you come across any Tempest patrols, then you should avoid engagement wherever possible. Does this mean I'm going to come across a Tempest patrol? Maybe. If they engage you, then make for altitude and outrun them. We believe the latest British fighter is somewhat breathless when the air starts to thin. Ah, and finally, a quick word about engine overheating. Good, I need a quick word about that. Remember, there are two ways to cool the engine. The first is to throttle down. The second is to increase your speed. Remember that in combat, if you keep your velocity above 600 kilometers an hour, you should have no problems with the turbines overheating whatsoever. Thank you for that. Um, all right, so looks like we're just going on a long patrol, fly down there, up there, around there, and then back there and here. Um, and possibility of tempest um, encounters is high, I would say, based on this briefing. So let's go. Here we are. And have I been promoted? Oh no, there's just two of us today. Is that because um, my two in one died in the last mission? Possibly. Start up the engines, make sure the power's on zero. 109s, you're outdated. Your time has passed, propeller based aircraft. Um, all engine selector, just make sure we've got that. Flaps down. That's the map. And let's just speed this a bit because we've seen this before. It's a takeoff. There's a convoy over there. Convoy 10 4, Big Chief, whatever the saying is. Normal speed. And let's take off. This is what it looks like when the aircraft takes off, or is about to take off, from the outside. Look at that wheel action. about ready. Two hundred and seventy kilometers an hour and we're up. Up the gear. And up the flaps. And we've got a hidden target which we've just completed. Joy. Okay, so we're probably gonna be flying at low level today. Got a long patrol ahead of us. So, it's skip time. Get ready. Three, two, one, skip. Oh, okay, I was using the auto. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, this is a terrible mistake. That was a bad idea. What the hell? Oh. Well, now what happened there, and I'm getting some kind of weird frame rate issues, it keeps, I don't know what's going on, so I'll probably have to start, restart the recording anyway, but what happened was that um, the autopilot throttled up, I switched off the autopilot, and my throttle was down, so the plane went wah, and the engines blew up, and for some reason the flaps started as well um, so there we go I'm just gonna going to land this thing or try and land it somewhere and restart the mission hopefully try and work out what's going on with the frame rate issue but uh, we have our answer about what we're going to encounter p51s sorry number one bailed out. 
See, it keeps, uh, this frame keeps skipping for some reason, I don't know why. I don't know why. Oh, an explosion on the mountain. Uh, let's just try and land in the field. Let's do that. Some farmhouses so we can get assistance there. If we survive, of course. Windmill. We're still going pretty fast. There's a house up ahead, so I need to avoid that. And the frames are still skipping. Oh god, there's a hill. Come on, whoa! And P51s. You can't get me, I'm on the ground. Well, you can get me, so I'll bail out. Just so I don't die. Run, my little strange-faced friend. That's a weird face. Okay. Um, so that was that. I'm going to quit the mission, and I will be reflying it. Um, once I've sorted out my problems. Um, so... I will cut back to when I'm about to encounter the P-51s again. Alright. Okay, I am back. Now, this will be mid-video for you, but for me, um, several days have passed. And if you watched the, one of my Silent Hunter videos, you would know that I accidentally deleted the entire game folder for this IL-2 installation I was using. So I've reinstalled it and I've taken the opportunity to upgrade to version 4.12 with the SES Mod Act thingamabob. Um, so I'm using that now. It may mean that the graphics might be slightly um, lower quality than we're used to, but on the other hand it means that the AI uh, should perform significantly better than they normally did. So. Um, Let's see how we go this time. Let's unpause it. Uh, engine 1. I should have all the same settings as before. Control settings. Um, and let's hope I don't die again. Or crash. It might be easier now because my lead uh, lead wingman person might fly a bit more sensibly rather than dying instantly. I don't know. Got a convoy over there. I might have mentioned that before. Let's speed things up a bit. Okay, and here we go. Make sure I don't fly off the runway. And we are away. Flaps down. Game might be a bit too loud actually. Sounds a bit louder than normal. But um We'll just have to see how it goes. I might have to turn it down a bit just to make sure it's not overwhelming the commentary. Um, yeah, so I'm up and away. I will cut here as usual until we get to the action part. So um, I will see you then.
Uh, my engine is on fire. I don't know why. That's not good. Um... This mission is just not going well for me. Where's my wingman gone? There he is. Um, I don't know if I can... Well, as long as I stay at a f sufficient speed, it shouldn't catch fire again. <laughs> oh, God. You know what? <sighs> to hell with it. If I, if I don't die in this mission, if I manage to bail out or whatever, you know, just crash and survive, I move on to the next one because I can't be bothered with this mission anymore. I must have moved the throttle too quickly, but I don't feel like I'm moving too quickly. I'm going at normal time compression. Uh, we should be nearing the point where we'll meet the enemy. I'm going to try and climb a little bit while I can. Try and let's go below about 600 kilometers an hour. The engine's still working. It's just um, very hot, I guess. Oh, where am I going? Still on course. Oh god, here are the P-51s. Where's my wingman? Okay, I need to pick up some more speed here. So I'll dive a little bit. Where's number one gone? Where's number one? I do not know. Oh, there he is. He's being chased. Okay. Now my engine's overheating. The engine's on fire again. Uh. God, I've lost number one again. And I did turn the the sound down, but now it feels too quiet. So we might have dodgy sound. This is just a dodgy, a dodgy mission. Everything has gone wrong. <laughs> uh, there's number one. Okay, I'm going to try and catch up with him, and help him out a bit, and maintain speed. boy. Now I can't really climb up there. Because if I do, my engine will catch on fire. So, uh, number one is kind of on his own, I think, right now. And we're losing speed as well, which I need to watch out for. Okay, I'm going a fair old lick now, so I might be able to climb a bit. But not too much. Well, despite the fact that my engine keeps catching on fire, this is probably the best I've done so far in this mission. I'm not dead, my wingman isn't dead. I am catching up with this P-51 up here, but he is turning quite aggressively. And I am going too slow. My engine is constantly overheating as well. Where did he go? I don't know. Uh, uh. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to try and dive a bit just to pick up a little bit more speed, I think. 
There's a big hill in the way. And my engine's on fire again. Why is it on fire? Stop being on fire! God, it's almost crashed. I should just go home. I should just go to base. And try and land. That's what I should do. Where am I? Not too far away, I don't think. No, there it is, okay. Um, number one. I might have to leave you. There's not much I can do for you anyway. Yeah, I'm afraid you're on your own. Something's gone wrong with my plane. I don't understand why it caught on fire because I didn't move the throttle that aggressively. But, um, obviously... It did. I did notice a new thing in the options. Um, for this version of the game. Which is kind of, like, kind of, I can't remember the exact words, but it was like, re uh, reliability or something like that. So I don't know... If maybe the plane will just break every now and again. I don't know. I need to maintain speed. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> I should just put it down in the fields, but I'd like to go back to the, air, the uh, airfield, the runway. Meanwhile, number one is still alive. Oh, no he's not. He's bailing out. Let's take a quick look. Is it FW190s? Oh, here he is. Yeah, he's bailing out. Um, meanwhile, I'm still heading back to base. How I will land, I do not know. Should I just turn number two off? Maybe I should just turn number two engine off. Uh, okay, let's try it. Select, select number two. Throttle down. Engine off. Select number one. Oh, whoa, whoa, no, hold on. Select number two again. Throttle up. Select number one. There. Engine no inoperable. That must be number two. Where's the airfield? It's over here somewhere. Will that stop it catching on fire? I, I hope so. Probably not. There's a the runway. Okay, so we need to turn this way. I'll be able to slow down a little bit. Yeah, this does sound kind of too quiet now with the game, so I might have to pump it up again. I guess I didn't save my uh, audio settings. Slow right down. Big turn. Reducing speed. Is there anything on the runway? I don't think so. And the engine's not catching on fire again, so it could be good. But I'm doing way too fast. I can try dropping the flaps, but I think it might just cause them to break. Um, um, I've got an idea. It's a little crazy. But it might work. Uh, 
And uh, in fact, I don't think it will work. I'm going too slow now. I was going to do a loop de loop. Well, an Immel one turn. And then drop down and uh, try again. But um, I don't think I'm going to be able to pick up enough speed. Or will I? I don't know. You know what? Let's just try it. No, this is not going to work. Okay. Never mind. Let's drop back down again. Hopefully I can pull up. Pull up, 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 pull up. Thank you. Down by the river. Okay. Um Where did the runway go? What is that? A city. I don't want to go there. Where's the oh here we go. Uh controlling this is quite difficult on one engine. That should now be slow enough for flaps. And hopefully landing gear. But I'm kind of under, out of control. Oh boy. Oh boy. Come on, come on. Come on. Just a little further. Ah, ah. Wow, I made it. <laughs> I survived. I landed. I don't believe it. Engine off. <sighs> well. That was interesting. But that's it. That's the mission over. We can move on to whatever horrors may face us next. Quick mission. Um, and as you can see, all the um, kills and deaths and everything is wrong. It's been a reset. But never mind. Doesn't really matter. Uh, but yeah, that was the uh, that mission. Kind of interesting and frustrating. But um, yep, yeah, thanks a lot for watching this episode, which was recorded over probably over a month. It took me to record this one episode, so um, thanks a lot for watching, and um, let's hope the next one is a little bit easier, um, a little bit easier, I should say, and, and uh, simpler to record. But um, oh, and by the way, also I've got um, over a thousand subscriptions now. Thanks everybody for subscribing to my channel of games, and I will be doing more games. I don't know whether I'll be doing one of those special 1,000 subscriber question and answer sessions or whatever people happen to do. If you think I should, then let me know and I might consider it. Otherwise, it'll just be more gaming videos. So, um, thanks a lot and I'll see you next time. Bye!